In this video, we'll go over the activation of the first encounter of the Zespers Host dungeon. The goal of this encounter is to get three nuclear bombs from three different areas to the center area and dunk them to get to the next encounter. To achieve this, you can use the operator and scanner buffs that are similar to Deepstone Crypt or the Seraph Shield mission. When you first come in, you reboot the room, a brig comes down. Nuke the brig as quickly as possible. Continue to kill ads. As you kill ads, a scanner will show up, a vandal. Kill him to get scanner. You'll notice there are three doors that are not shielded that will have like a heart or lung or other symbols on top of that. You'll go through one of those and you'll just slay out ads as you're heading further down. As you get closer to where you have to use the scanner, you'll actually see some large enemies. You'll need to kill those. As you kill them, a force field will come down and you'll be able to dunk the scanner. One of the reasons you want to do this is you do have a minute timer on it. So try to get them down as quickly as possible. Put the scanner in temporarily if you need to. When you kill all the ads, an operator will actually show up and you'll have to kill that vandal as well to get the operator. Now, how this works is there are gonna be a number of panels that you can shoot as the operator. Now, you're not gonna know which ones to shoot. When you're going through, you're gonna notice that they're all lit up yellow. They look like, on your radar, they look like yellow, yellow icons. As you pass by them, you'll see them either turn white, which means they're valid to shoot, or they'll clear out, which means they aren't. There are already, always, in each of these areas, there's two that are not valid. So you can either number these, you know, one, two, three, four, whatever you want to number them, or you could simply have the operator go right with the scanner and the operator can say, no, shoot this one, don't shoot that one. So again, you need to shoot all but two of them. As soon as you find the two that clear out, you at that point, the operator can just continue shooting everything else in the room. Once you do this, the scanner and the operator are going to want to take their, their buffs and they're going to dunk them in the little wash tubs. The reason for that is that will take them to the other room so they'll have to kill the vandals again. The other person's in the room can pick up the bomb. The bomb has a minute timer when it's on the ground, so it does have a little bit of time where you can drop it. The other thing is you get radiation as you take the bomb forward. When that radiation gets to 10, you die. So you're really just going to play trade. So you're going to take it forward, similar to Deep Stone Crypt. When you get your radiation a little further on, someone's going to kind of take it from you. And just keep doing that. Get back to the center room. Kill the brig that's in the middle and the ads. Once the brig is down, you'll be able to deposit the bomb in any of the three locations in the back. Again, it's not something where you have to scan and find which one. At that point, you can just do it. Do this a total of three times in the three different areas and you complete the encounter. That's the video, guys. If you like it, feel free to like the video, subscribe to my channel, jump my Discord, and I'll see you going to the tower.